Welcome to the Studio Cloud's video tutorial on exporting your task types and tap task statuses and tasks from Studio Plus into Studio Cloud. Um, those are the words that Studio Plus uses in Studio Cloud. We use them pipeline and pipeline steps and tasks. So to start off with, we're going to uh, export out the pipelines or in Studio Plus they're called uh, task types. We're going to go down to maintenance, go to task, then click on task statuses. Here we go. And then uh, this is how you switch between the different task types. And we're going to go ahead and uh, select the first one, click export to Excel. And we're going to call the first one, let's go ahead and call it the name of that task type, customer service issue. We're going to save it. Then we're going to select the next one. And you would have to do this for every single one. We're going to call this one request for proposal and we're going to save it and uh, for some reason in Studio Plus it opens up Excel automatically when you do that so uh, you go to your Excel, you either manually open that up that Excel file or if Studio Plus has opened it up for you go ahead and go to it and we're going to do a save as file and we're going to save it as a CSV file We're going to come down to CSV and we're going to save it. All right, that is how you export that, and you'd want to do that for the other one as well. Then we're going to import that into Studio Cloud. To import the file into Studio Cloud, you click on Projects, you click on Settings, and then Manage Pipelines. Click on the New General Project Pipeline. Then we're going to go Import Options, Import from CSV. We're going to go ahead and select the one customer service issue. And I ended up uh, doing both of them, just uh, didn't record it, just to uh, speed things up. Customer service issue. It's called the name of a customer service issue. We're just going to go ahead and uh, save that one. It's right there, and then we're going to do a new one. Report options. The other one's called uh, request for proposal. Request. For proposal. We'll just go ahead and say that. And that's how you create a pipeline in Studio Cloud. Let's go ahead and import the tasks from Studio Plus into Studio Cloud now. So what you need to do is close the uh, the uh, window you had open, which was the uh, um, task statuses window, and come click on tasks if you're not there already. We're going to click on the column chooser option here. And then we're going to click on uh, client first name right there and client last name. And then we're going to scroll down to the tasks. And here we have the description, the due date, the priority start date, task status, tasks subject and task type, all those. So um, should look relatively like this. Let's go ahead and export it to Excel. And we're going to call this uh, Studio Plus Tasks. Save button. And we have right here the Studio Plus tasks that we use in the example data that uh, Studio Plus provided. We'll go ahead and uh, save these out as a CSV file. CSV. Go ahead and save that. And we'll go ahead and import that into Studio Cloud. To import it into Studio Cloud, um, click on Projects, go to the Projects Orders tab, click Import Options, Import Projects and Orders. We're going to import from the Studio Plus file. We're going to select the Studio Plus tasks here, and it will import it for us. It uh, shows you all the information it's going to import. When you're ready, go ahead and click the Save button, and it will create those projects and import them for you into, Studio, into Studio Cloud. And that's how you import the tasks into Studio Cloud from Studio Plus.